welcome back to the channel. Today we're covering a game that I am really excited about. First saw this uh, game a little while ago. Hellblade Sinua's Sacrifice. So I saw the game a little while ago and at first I just thought it looked good. Um, I was impressed with um, how good the game actually just looked. I didn't know anything about the game, the developers, nothing like that. Um, but I later found out uh, the game is actually developed and published by a, a British developer, which is Ninja Theory. Um, they have a vlog series, uh, vlog diaries, I think you can call it. That's actually on their YouTube um, that I actually looked up and they actually go over the whole development process and how they, you know, did the environment and why they made certain choices and even the main character, which is played by Melina Jurgens. She was actually just the, you know, video editor for the vlog series. Um, they needed to fill in and eventually, obviously she's literally the face of the game. Um, but she wasn't an actress. Um, you know, she talks, she's just a normal person, which is crazy. It's like a normal person and she gets, you know, the, the, the chance to actually be an actual character in a game. Uh, she's what, 26, I believe. And she's on Instagram with like two, 3000 followers. So she's just a normal person. Uh, so I think it's great when, uh, you know, a normal person get an opportunity like that, but the game at this point is only coming out on PS4 and obviously PC, um, but it does have pro support, um, which you can either do 1440p or the 60 FPS mode. Um, it should be coming to Xbox One at a later date. Um, I do not know what that date is, but it's supposed to. Uh, but this game, it just looks amazing. It's about mental health, and obviously mental health is a serious issue, but it's, it just seems like it'll be a real immersive type of game, and you can connect with the character and actually enjoy the game, not just about, you know, hack and slash type of thing. Uh, but it is in a store right now. You can only get it as a digital copy. It is $30. I just feel like we should support a studio doing great work um, because that'll help fund them continuing to do great work. So, like I said, there's their, uh, you know, YouTube and all their information. Please check it out. If you like the video, please like and subscribe. Thanks.